Ask a free car question at twocarpros.com. Hello and welcome to Two Car Pros. Today we're going to show you how to replace the rear brake pads and rotors for a Subaru Legacy between the years of 2003 and 2009. The first thing we need to do is remove the wheel. Next we need to begin to unbolt the caliper. With the caliper removed, we can remove the brake pads. Now we can remove the caliper mounting assembly. Next we're going to remove the rotor. We're going to use some WD-40 to loosen everything up. Next we're going to use these bolts as a sort of press to get the rotor off of the hub. Next, we're going to compare our old rotor to the new one to make sure that it's identical. Once we're sure that it's identical, we're going to take some carburetor spray and clean the manufacturing grease off of the new rotor. Now we can replace the rotor. Now we can replace the caliper mounting assembly. Next, we're going to take one of the old brake pads, a large pair of channel locks, and we're going to force the caliper piston back into the caliper assembly. Now, this process relies on more of consistency of force than the amount of force. Next, we're going to compare our old brake pads to our new ones to make sure that they're identical.
Now we can replace the brake pads that we removed earlier. And now we can replace the caliper. Next, we need to replace the wheel, making sure we bolt it on in a star pattern. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please visit twocarbros.com.